today we are going to learn one poem from A level literature syllabus uh, that is sonnet number 141 uh, that, uh, that is written by William Shakespeare. Uh, in this poem, uh, William Shakespeare is addressing to dark lady. So we are going to see a uh, kind of a contrasting situation uh, uh, that is uh, the appearance and the uh, reality. That is parallel between the appearance versus reality. From the appearance, uh, we can see uh, certain uh, conditions. Uh, in the reality, the conditions is different. So we are going to learn this poem in brief. Now let, uh, let's read the poem. In, uh, read the poem in uh, in real. Uh, the poet persona do not love thee with thine eyes. From the real sense, he is not uh, loving uh, with, uh, with that uh, lady. For they, uh, for they, in thee, thousand errors know. Uh, for their condition, thousand errors. Thousand errors means an uh, overstatement, that is a hyperbole in this uh, in this one. Right? So the hyperbole is there, no. So uh, you can also learn about A, B, A, B, uh, C, D, C, D, E, F, D, D, uh, E, F, G, D, uh, rhyming pattern. So that is we call uh, uh, rhyming pattern. Pattern in uh, Elizabethan era. Uh, that is also uh, from uh, this part to here, the eight line we call octave. From the octave, uh, we have a argument, and from the system, we have the uh, solution or the resolution that also we have to keep in our understanding. Right now, thousand errors mean, uh, I mean the errors that are committed by the uh, lady, so that's a high goal here. But uh, this my heart that loves what they despise. Uh, but the, con but the uh, contrasting situation is my heart that loves. The heart, uh, although the speaker notes about errors, uh, he cannot get rid of this love. The heart loves what they despise. So uh, you can see kind of a contrast. The heart loves, uh, but despise comes from the senses. Right? From the senses, we see the despise. Who in despite of you? So you can see a contrast from the real uh, senses, uh, notice a uh, thousand errors, but uh, uh, from the uh, heart, uh, foolish heart, the speaker is uh, enthralled in with the lover. Despite of you, he is to God. So here there is a direct contrast between the appearance and the reality, the appearance from the senses not in the errors and the reality in the real sense. No, here we see parallel structures. No, our mind ears with the tongue tune. Tongue tune means the third sound, that is a kind of alliteration. Uh, it gives hard effect for the poem and no sound brings about a kind of a musical effect for the poem. We like it. No tender feeling to bear such a form. So, this is a kind of a tender feeling because you see a kind of a, uh, I mean, loving. Uh, romantic feelings like that. No taste, no smell, no desire to be invited. Now here you see uh, there is a from the senses because uh, from the senses he not the ears, so uh, he is not interested. The boy person is not interested from the senses to be invited uh, to the uh, to the dark lady. No to any sensual feast or kind of a special event or something. Not to be invited. Be alone because uh, from the senses he knows that uh, the errors, yeah, uh, the errors so he, uh, the first person does not like to invite the dark lady. From the first uh, we can understand this is we call Volta. Uh, Volta means the changing point of the argument. But my five weeks, five weeks means the intelligence, intellect. From the five intelligence, no my five senses can. This way, get tricked of one foolish heart because now this heart has become foolish, a kind of a meaningless thing because the heart has an enthralling att attraction to the dark lady from serving thee who leaves uns uh, unswayed the likeness of a man. So it's very difficult to get rid of that kind of a love. Uh, thy proud heart slave. Now the heart has become a kind of a slave to the uh, dark lady. In other words, it's a kind of a disease, uh, it's a kind of a, this 
is like that. Vessel H to B. Uh, the last two lines, uh, kind of a coupler, argues uh, strongly about this point. Only my plane, now it's a kind of a metaphor there. Uh, love plate means uh, love sickness because this hearts, uh, foolish condition and attaching the lover. So it's a kind of a uh, irresistible attachment towards the uh, uh, dark lady. That's why I count my day. The poet person wants me count the things that he gained. Uh, that she, uh, that she, that makes roads be the way. So the final result is the uh, sadness that you gain from this irresistible attachment uh, towards the dark lady. So thank you very much for being with me. So we are going to learn some more things in uh, upcoming videos. I go on.